Mathura district situated along the banks of the river Yamuna is a district of Uttar Pradesh state of northern India. The historic town of Mathura is the district headquarters. The district is part of Agra division. Mathura is bounded on the northeast by Aligarh district, on the southeast by Hathras district, on the south by Agra district, and on the west by Rajasthan and northwest by Haryana state. Mathura district is an important pilgrimage centre of Hindus. Many towns in the district Mathura have banned alcohol and non-veg food. Historical background Mathura has an ancient history. According to the Archaeological Survey of India plaque at the Mathura Museum, the city is mentioned in the oldest Indian epic, the Ramayana. In the epic, the Ikshwaku prince Shatruna slays a demon called Levanasura and claims the land. Afterwards, the place came to be known as Madhuvan as it was thickly wooded, then Madhapura and later Mathura. In the 6th century BCE, Mathura became the capital of the Surasena Mahajanapada. The city was later ruled by the Maurya Empire, 4th to 2nd centuries BC, and the Shunga dynasty, 2nd century BC. It may have come under the control of Indo-Greeks some time between 180 BCE and 100 BC. It then reverted to local rule before being conquered by the Indo-Scythians during the 1st century BC. Mathuran art and culture reached its zenith under the Kushan dynasty which had Mathura as one of their capitals, the other being Purushapura Peshawar. The dynasty had kings with the names of Kujula Kadphises, Kanishka, Huvishka and Vasudeva the first Megasthenes, writing in the early 3rd century BC, mentions Mathura as a great city under the name Methora, Methora. The Indo-Scythians aka Sakas or Shakas conquered the area of Mathura over Indian kings around 60 BCE. The findings of ancient stone inscriptions in Magara, a town 17 kilometers, 11 miles from Mathura, provide historical artifacts giving more details on this era of Mathura. The opening of the three-line text of these inscriptions are in Brahmi script and were translated as, "...in the 116th year of the Greek kings". The Indo-Scythian satraps of Mathura are sometimes called the "...northern satraps", as opposed to the "...western satraps" ruling in Gujarat and Malwa. After Rajuvula, several successors are known to have ruled as vassals to the Kushans, such as the ''Great Satrap'' Karapalana and the ''Satrap'' Vanaspara, who are known from an inscription discovered in Sarnath, and dated to the third year of Kanishka c. 130 AD, in which they were paying allegiance to the Kushans. Mathura served as one of the Kushan Empire's two capitals from the 1st to the 3rd centuries. F. A. Xi'an mentions the city, as a center of Buddhism about AD 400, while his successor Xuanzang, who visited the city in 634 AD, which he mentions as Motulo, and said that it contained 20 Buddhist monasteries and five Brahmanical temples. Later, he went east to Thanissar, Jalandhar in the eastern Punjab, before climbing up to visit predominantly Theravada monasteries in the Kulu Valley and turning southward again to Bhairat and then Mathura. On the Yamuna River, the city was sacked and many of its temples destroyed by Mahmud of Ghazni in 1018 and again by Sikandar Lodi, who ruled the Sultanate of Delhi from 1489 to 1517. Sikandar Lodi earned the epithet of but Khan, the destroyer of Hindu deities. The Mughal emperor Aurangzeb built the city's Jaimi Masjid, Friday Mosque. The noteworthy fact is that the exact place of birth of Lord Krishna, according to historians, is in the place of worship of the Hindus, though the mosque was built near the birthplace of Lord Krishna. The bigger Krishna shrine, better known as Dwarkadish Temple as a few meters away from what is believed to be the actual birthplace of Krishna, was built in 1815 by Seth Gokuda's Parikh, treasurer of Gwalior. Demographics 
According to the 2011 census Matura district has a population of 2,541,894, roughly equal to the nation of Kuwait or the U.S. state of Nevada. This gives it a ranking of 167th in India out of a total of 640. The district has a population density of 761 inhabitants per square kilometer, 1970 per square miles. Its population growth rate over the decade 2001 to 2011 was 22.53%. Matura has a sex ratio of 858 females for every 1,000 males, and a literacy rate of 72.65%. Matura is a Jat-dominated region with around 5.30 lakh Jat. Matura receives a large number of daily visitors besides pilgrims who stay for an average of three days. Matura's urban area's floating population on normal days is between 100,000 and 125,000 per days, whereas on festive and auspicious days it is over twice the population of urban area. <laughs> Language People in Matura and nearby areas speak Braj. Braj Basha Devanagari, Brahabasa Gurmukhi, Brahabasa also called Bridge Basha, Briabasa Vajabasa Braj Baka, Brahabaka Brahabaka or Dahati Zaban, Dahati Zabana Dahati Zabana country tongue, is a Western Hindi language closely related to Hindustani. In fact, it is usually considered to be a dialect of Western Hindi, and along with Awadi a variety of Eastern Hindi was one of the two predominant literary languages of north-central India before the switch to Hindustani in the 19th century. Braj Basha language, also spelled Braj Basa, Braj Baka, or Bridge Basa, language descended from Sharasini Prakrit and commonly viewed as a Western dialect of Hindi. It is spoken by some 575,000 people, primarily in India. Its purest forms are spoken in the cities of Mathura, Agra, Edda, and Aligarh. Most speakers of Braj Basha worship the Hindu deity Krishna. Their bhakti devotion finds expression in the language, which has a very firm base in folk literature and songs. Almost all of the enactments of episodes from Krishna's life that are performed during the Janmashtami festival, celebrating Krishna's birth, are presented in Braj Basha. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Geography and Climate. Mathura is located at 27.28 degrees north 77.41 degrees east, 27.28, 77.41. It has an average elevation of 174 metres 570 feet. The climate of Matura is tropical extreme with very hot summers with temperatures rising beyond 44 degrees Celsius, and cold and foggy winters with temperature dipping to 5 degrees Celsius. The average rainfall is 793 mm, received mostly during the monsoons from July to September. Administration. Region of Mathura was added to British territory in 1803 AD. Till 1832 AD, when Mathura was recognised as district, the region was partly administered from Agra and partly from Satabad. <laughs> <laughs> Strategic importance Mathura is the home for Indian First Corps strike formation within the Indian Army's Central Command, hosting Strike First Corps headquarters in a large classified area in the outskirts of the city known as Mathura Cantonment Central Command itself has its headquarters at Lucknow. It hosts strike infantry units, air defence units, armoured divisions, engineer brigades, artillery units and classified units of Strategic Nuclear Command. 
Core I is primarily responsible for western borders of India. In 2007 during exercise Ashwamedha, all the armoured, artillery and infantry divisions performed a simulation of an overall NBC nuclear chemical biological environment. The aim was to show operational ability in high intensity, short duration and sudden battles. Politics Mathura is governed by a number of bodies, the most important being the Mathura Nagar Nigam municipal corporation, which is responsible for the master planning of the city. Member of Parliament Lok Shabha duration name of the member political party First 1952–1957 Giraj Saran Singh Independent Second 1957–1962 Raja Mahendra Pratap Independent Third 1962–1967 Chaudhry Digambar Singh Indian National Congress 4th 1967 to 1971 Giraj Saran Singh Independent 5th 1971 to 1977 Shaklashwar Singh Indian National Congress 6th 1977 to 1980 Mani Ram Bagri Bharatiya Lok Dal 7th 1980 to 1984 Chaudhry Digambar Singh Janata Party Secular 8th 1984–1989 Manvendra Singh Indian National Congress 9th 1989–1991 Manvendra Singh Janata Dal 10th 1991–1996 Swami Sakshi G. Bharatiya Janata Party 11th 1996–1998 Chaudhry Tevir Singh Bharatiya Janata Party 12th 1998–1999 Chaudhry Tevir Singh Bharatiya Janata Party 13th 1999–2004 Chaudhry Tevir Singh Bharatiya Janata Party 14th 2004–2009 Manvendra Singh Indian National Congress 15th 2009–2014 Jayant Chaudhry Rashtriya Lok Dal 16th 2014 incumbent Hema Malini Bharatiya Janata Party Topic Healthcare Health care facilities in Mathura are provided by central state and local government facilities besides numerous private providers as per the recent District Level Household and Facility Survey DLHS3 2007-2008, only 33% of currently married women are using a modern method of contraception, which is lower than the state average of 34.8%. Usage of any modern method, though, is higher in Matura in comparison to the state's average of 26.7%. The percentage of IUD, pill and condom usage is again below the state average. The DLHS-3 estimates unmet family planning need in Matura at 38.9%, 9.8% unmet need for spacing methods and 29.1% unmet need for limiting methods. The percentage of birth of order 3 and above is quite high at 46.9%. Matura has lesser percentage of girls marrying before 18 years of age, which is 31.6% in comparison with the state average of 33.1%. But the most alarming statistic is that of mothers who had at least three antenatal care visits during the last pregnancy, which is only 21% as compared to the state average of 64.4%. Public infrastructure Economy and industry 
One of the major contributors in the economy of Uttar Pradesh are Mathura Industries. Mathura Refinery located in the city is one of the biggest oil refineries of Asia. This oil refinery of the Indian Oil Corporation is a highly technologically advanced oil refinery. Mathura Refinery is the first in Asia and third in the world to receive the coveted ISO 14001 certification for environment management system in 1996. Textile printing industry that includes both sari printing and fabric dyeing and silver ornaments manufacturing are major industrial contributors to the region. Apart from these other industries are water tap manufacturing units and other decorative and household items. Matura also is a big center for production of cotton materials, prominent among them being pure white, bleached cotton saris for women and dhotis for men, and cotton niwar tapes for beds. It is also a hub for production of milk-based sweet meats, prominent among them being matura pitas and burfis. Renowned as the place where rivers of milk flowed, Mathura till today boasts of milk trading centers where you can buy any amount of fresh milk where rates vary every few minutes and are notified on a blackboard akin to stock prices. <laughs> <laughs> Education Sakdeva Institute of Technology, GLA University, RK. Group of institutions including Rajiv Academy for Technology Management, Rajiv Academy for Teachers Education, Rajiv Academy for Pharmacy, KD. Dental College Hospital, Rajiv International School, etc., BSA College of Engineering and Technology, Excel Institute of Management Technology has been accorded as status of university. 40 Engineering Management colleges had been established in Mathura up to 12 December 2009. Mathura is home to the Uttar Pradesh Pandit Dean Dayal Upadhyaya Veterinary University, the first of its kind in the state and the fourth in the country to be made independent veterinary universities. The university is located on the Mathura Agra Road, about 5 km miles from M. Famous Government Engineering College. Bharatpur is located at 35 km from Mathura. Many schools like Parmeshwari Devi Donaka, Hanuman Prashad Donaka, Kana Makan Public School, Kana Makan Millennium School, Amarnath Vidya Ashram, Sacred Heart, St. Dominic's, Ramanlal Shorawala and Rajiv International School are also located here. Culture and religion The ethos of Mathura, and in fact the whole of Braj Mandal is centered on Krishna and his tales. Mathura sees heightened activities during the major festivities dedicated to Krishna. The residents or natives of Mathura are called Brijwasi. Mathura is famous for its sweets and chaat. Language <laughs> <laughs> The language spoken in the Braj Mandal is mainly Hindi which is spoken in a different dialect. This dialect is characteristic with the Braj and known as Brabhasha. Before Hindi and until past few centuries, Brabhasha used to be the dominant dialect in literature. <laughs> Dance Raslilas of Mathura have become an integral part of Indian folklore. According to popular belief, Krishnaji had danced the Raas with gopis on banks of Yamuna River. Charkula is a traditional folk dance of the Braj. In this dance, a woman balances a column of Deepakas on her head and dances to the accompaniment of Rasiya songs by the menfolk. Art 
Mathura school of art, style of Buddhist visual art that flourished in the Mathura, from the 2nd century BC to the 12th century AD. Its most distinctive contributions were made during the Kushan and Gupta periods. 1st, 6th century AD. Images in the modelled red sandstone from the nearby Sikri quarries are found widely distributed over north central India, attesting to Mathura's importance as an exporter of sculpture. The Mathura school images are related to the earlier Yaksa male nature deity figures, a resemblance particularly evident in the colossal standing Buddha images of the early Kushan period. In these, and in the more representative seated Buddhas, the overall effect is one of enormous energy. The shoulders are broad, the chest swells, and the legs are firmly planted with feet spaced apart. These days, around 1,000 craftsmen are involved in making wall hangings at Holy Gate and Chowk Bazaar in the pilgrim town of Mathura. These wall hangings delve on religious themes and mostly revolve around Radha and Lord Krishna seated on a swing, Lord Krishna playing flute along with Radha and gopis, Lord Krishna with herds of cattle, Goddess Saraswati, Vaishno Devi and Lord Vishnu. Wall hangings have the gods and goddesses in highly embellished form, marking the high points of the Mathura school of paintings. Once the brush work is over, the figures are adorned with colorful stars and mica pieces to make them attractive. One of the most brilliant artworks of Mathura school of paintings is Goddess Lakshmi in the midst of lotus flowers. Sanji is the colorful art of decorating the ground with flowers. Music. Rasiya is a tradition that is integral to Mathura's culture. It is the tradition of folk songs that describe the love of the divine couple Radha and Krishnaji. It is an inseparable part of the holy celebrations and all other festive occasions at Mathura. Dulendi, holy with drums, dolak, colors, etc., originated from Braj region hundreds of millennia before today. Sports Traditional sports like kabaddi, gili danda, etc. Active participation in state-level cricket. Other sports like netball, hockey and swimming are also popular. Religion Mathura is one of the seven most holy places for Hindus in India. Ayodhya Mathura Maya Kasi Kanshi Avantika I Puri Dvaravati Cheva Saptita Moksadeika II Garuda Purana I 16.14 A Kasetra is a sacred ground, a field of active power, a place where moksha, final release can be obtained. The Garuda Purana enumerates seven cities as giver of moksha, they are Ayodhya, Mathura, Maya, Kasi, Kanshi, Avantika, Puri and Dvaravati. Tourism Temples <tourism> 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 Shri Krishna Janbhumi is a Hindu temple complex located in heart of city of Mathura. Hindus consider it as one of the most sacred place as they believe that the temple stands on the same place where ancient Hindu god Lord Krishna was born. The complex have a Kshavdev temple where spiritual environment could be felt during morning prayer Mangla Arti. The temple complex have a museum, where numerous articles excavated from the site related to story of Sri Krishna birth are displayed. Dwarkadish Temple, built in 1814, is a popular temple near the banks of Yamuna River in Mathura city. This temple is managed by followers of Vallabhakariya. The temple is fairly interesting architecturally. People engaged in bhajan kirtan inside temple before daily morning prayer Mangla Arti gives an impression of festival and celebration. 
Gita Mandir is situated at a distance of nearly 5 km from Mathura Junction in way of Rindaban from Mathura City is popular attractions of Mathura. The magnificent Mandir was built by Birla, one of the leading industrial powers of India. The excellent architecture of the temple attracts tourists from all over India. The whole of Gita, the sacred book of the Hindus, is inscribed on the temple. Beautiful carvings and paintings enhance the beauty of the temple. There is a beautiful image of Lord Krishna as present in the sanctum of the Mandir. Rangaji Temple, built in 1851 is dedicated to Lord Ranganatha or Rangaji depicted as Lord Vishnu in his Sheshashayi pose, resting on the coils of the sacred Shesha Nag. The temple built in the Dravidian style has a tall gopuram gateway of six stories and a gold, plated dwaja stamba, 50 feet high. A water tank and a picturesque garden lie within the temple enclosure. The annual festival of Jal Vihar of the presiding deity is performed with great pomp and splendor at the tank. The temple is also famous for its backquote Brahmatsdav celebration during the month of Kshetra March to April, more popularly known as the backquote Rath Ka Mela. The ten-day-long celebrations are marked by the pulling of the Rath, the chariot car, by the devotees from the temple to the adjoining gardens. Jugal Kisha Temple was built in the 17th century after Emperor Akbar's visit to Vridaban in the year 1570. He ordered four temples to be built by the Gaudiya Vaisnavas, which were Madana Mohana, Govindaji, Gopinatha, and Jugal Kasur. The temple is located near Kesi Ghat in Vrindaban and also called as Kesi Temple. Radharaman Temple is another name of ancient Hindu god Lord Krishna, which means one who gives pleasure to Radha. The Siva Puja of Radharamana was established in 1542, after the deity self manifested from a salagram sila. Also kept in this temple is the wooden sitting place Hoki and shawl chatter or Lord Chaitanya, that he gave as a gift to Gopala Bhatta Gosvami who built the temple. There is no deity of Radharani in this temple, but a crown is kept next to Krishna signifying her presence. Jaipur Temple which was built by Sawai Madhav Singh, the Maharaja of Jaipur in 1917, is a richly embellished and opulent temple located in Vrindaban. The fine hand, carved sandstone is of unparalleled workmanship. The temple is dedicated to Sri Radha Madhav. Shaja Temple, another popular temple at Vrindavan, was designed and built in 1876 by a wealthy jeweler, Shah Kundan Lal of Lucknow. The deities at the temple are popularly known as the Chahote Radha Raman. Noted for its magnificent architecture and beautiful marble sculpture, the temple has 12 spiral columns each 15 feet high. The backquote Basanti camera, the Darbar Hall, is famed for its Belgian glass chandeliers and fine paintings. Vrindavan Chandradaya Mandir is the world's tallest temple under construction at Mathura. At cost of 300 crore rupees, 42 million dollars, it will be one of the most expensively built temple in world by ISKCON. Prem Mandir is the most beautiful and clean, religious and spiritual complex situated on a 54-acre site on the outskirts of Rindavan, is one of the newest temples dedicated to Sri Krishna. The temple structure was established by spiritual guru Kripalu Maharaj. The main structure built in marble looks incredibly beautiful and is an educational monument that reflects the true history of Sanatana Dharma. Figures of Sri Krishna and his followers depicting important events surrounding the Lord's existence cover the main temple, Sri Vrindavan Chandra Mandir HKM Vrindavan, located in Vrindavan, is a replica of that supreme Goloka Vrindavana in the spiritual sky. It was inaugurated in 2006 on the most auspicious day of Sri Rama Navami Day. The temple is housed in an ultra-modern geodesic structure with a traditional gopuram based on Kajuraho style of architecture, greeting pilgrims at the entrance. 
The major festivals of the temple are Sri Krishna Janmashtami, Sri Radhashtami, Kartik Fest, seven-day festival during Govardhan Puja time, and Gora Purnima. Grand Abhishekas are performed for Sri Sri Radha Vrindavan Chandra during festivals such as Radhashtami and Janmashtami. Sri Radha Ras Bihari Ashta Sakhi Temple in Vrindavan, the Lila Stan. The place of the Divine Passion Play of Lord Krishna, lies the temple that is a must-visit destination for devotees completing the 84 Kosh Vraj Parikrama Yatra. The temple is centuries old and is the first Indian temple that is dedicated to the Divine Couple and their Ashta Sakis, the eight «companions» of Radha who were intimately involved in her love play with the Lord Krishna. The Ashtasakis are mentioned in the ancient texts of Puranas and the Bhagavata Purana. The temple is called Sri Radha Ras Bihari Ashtasaki Mandir and it is home to the divine Rasa Lila of Lord Krishna and Radharani. It is located in close proximity to the Bank Bihari Temple. Legend has it that the Sri Radha Rasa Bihari Ashta Saki Mandir is one of the two places in Mathura, Vrindavan where the Lord Krishna actually indulges in the Rasa Lila with his beloved Radha and her Sakis. On these nights, devotees have reported hearing the sound of the anklets, beating in tune to a divine melody. Govind Deo Temple was once a magnificent seven storied structure built in the form of a Greek cross. It is said that the Emperor Akbar donated some of the red sandstone that had been brought for the Red Fort at Agra, for the construction of this temple. Built at the astronomical cost of 1 crore rupees in 1590 by his general Man Singh, the temple combines Western, Hindu and Muslim architectural elements in its structure. Krishna Balaram Mandir is a Gaudiya Vaishnava temple in the holy city of Rindavan. It is one of the main Iskan temples in India and internationally. Krishna Balaram Mandir was built in 1975 on the orders of Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, the founder Acharya of the International Society for Krishna Consciousness Iskan. Ghat Vishram Ghat is a ghat, a bath and worship place, on the banks of River Yamuna. It is the main ghat of Mathura city and is central to 25 other ghats. The traditional parikrama starts and ends at Vishram Ghat. Lord Krishna is said to have rested at this place after killing Kansa. Some notable places in Mathura district Mathura, the town Gokul Mahawan Baldev Raya Vrindaban Govardhan Barsana Nangaon Kosi Kalan Phara Mant Nahajil Bina Surir Bidani Akosh Topic: Religious festivals. Topic: Krishna Janmashtami. Krishna Janmashtami is celebrated on the eighth day, Ishtama, of the Krishna Paksha, dark fortnight of the month of Shravana, August September, in the Hindu calendar. Rasa Lila dramatic enactments of the life of Krishna, are a special feature in Mathura. There is a huge arati at 12 midnight in temples all over Vrindavana. <laughs> Guru Purnima Guru Purnima is a Hindu festival dedicated to spiritual and academic teachers. This festival takes place in the month of Asada June to July. It is customary to worship the spiritual master on this day. Millions of people visit Mathura on Guru Purnima because of the presence of thousands of spiritual gurus in Mathura. 
On this day many devotees gather at Manasi Ganga and do Gavardhana Parikrama. Braj Parikrama Braj Parikrama is a pilgrimage of all the places in Braj that associated with Sri Krishna, is undertaken. Traditionally, the Churasi Kos, 84 Kos pilgrimage of Braj Mandal, with its 12 vanas forests, 24 upvanas groves, sacred hill Gavardhan, divine river Yamuna and numerous holy places along its banks, is undertaken annually by lakhs of devotees from all over the country. The Yatra extends to Kotban to the north of Mathura, to Nangaon, Barsana and the Gavardhan Hill to the west and southwest of the city and to the banks of the Yamuna to the east, where the Baldeo Temple is located. Colorful milas and performances of the Raslila a depiction of the exploits of Sri Krishna in Braj Parikrama are distinctive to rainy month of Badon, the month when the Lord Krishna was born, is a time of colorful celebrations. Radhastami Radhastami is the appearance day of Radharani. This festival falls on the eighth day, of the bright fortnight in the month of Bhadra August Sept, 15 days after the appearance of Lord Krishna. This festival is very joyously celebrated in whole Mathura region with its centre in Varsana. There is an all-night kirtana held the night before Radhastami at the Larilla Lal Temple in Varsana, ending with an ecstatic Mangala Arati. Many people go to Varsana on this day. <laughs> Vasant Panchmi Vasant Panchami, a festival that marks the commencement of spring season, is widely celebrated in Mathura. The festival marks the beginning of celebrations of Holi in Mathura. Special religious programs are organized in other temples of across the district, like in Banki Bihari Temple of Vrindaban pilgrims celebrate the occasion by tossing rose powder. <laughs> Lath Mar Holi Lath Mar Holi is a local celebration of the Hindu festival of Holi. It takes place well before the actual Holi in the town of Barsana. The name means, "...that Holi in which people hit with sticks." In the sprawling compound of the Radha Rani temple in Barsana, thousands gather to witness the Lath Mar Holi when women beat up men with sticks lath as those on the sidelines become hysterical, sing holy songs and shout Shri Radhe or Shri Krishna. <laughs> Jal Julin This is the swing festival at the Ranganatha temple. At night the temple tank is lit up. This festival is on the 11th day of the month of Bhadra August to Sept. <laughs> Julan Yatra Mahatsava This festival lasts for 13 days. It starts on the Tritya third day of the bright fortnight of Sravana July to August and lasts until the full moon night of the month. During this festival the Radha Krishna deities in the temples are swung on a swing. This is one of the biggest festivals of the year and Vrindavana is very crowded at this time. Often the swings are gold and silver. Some of the main temples that this festival is celebrated at are the Bank Bihari Temple and the Radha Raman Temple in Vrindavana, the Dwarkadish Temple in Mathura, and the Larali Lal Temple in Varsana. Transport Mathura is on the main lines of the central railways and is connected with all the important cities of Uttar Pradesh and India such as Delhi, Agra, Lucknow, Mumbai, Jaipur, Gwalior, Kolkata, Hyderabad and Chennai. 
The nearest airport is Caria, Agra, 62 km away from Matura. Matura is also well connected by motorable roads to important cities in the region. See also Vrindavan Road Railway Station Vrindavan Railway Station Ajay Railway Station Bidani Koloni Pygon Citation <inaudible> <inaudible>